Hi, here is Jairo, Melty Applications Engineer, and today we are going to show you how we manufacture this fire pump impeller. Here we have a comparison between the damaged part and the printed part. Close impeller face a really high stress during the startup, jumping from rest to full speed, demanding a lot of torque to overcome the inertia, putting extra load on the blades, shaft, and bearings. Also, during the first second of the startup, the fluid isn't fully developed, so it could create low pressure areas that could damage the impeller. Once running, the impeller also endurance wear, driven by fatigue, vibration, cavitation, erosion, or galvanic corrosion. Traditional casting can take months to deliver a single impeller. That's not ideal when you are working with critical components that can't afford long downtimes. With additive manufacturing, we can drastically cut lead times, producing complex parts on demand without waiting for molds or tooling. This also means that we don't need to keep a lot of parts in storage, producing them when and where they are needed. In conclusion, adopting additive manufacturing is a smarter, faster, and much more flexible approach for industrial maintenance and repairs. 